air, we put handheld ultrasound in the hands of a broad mix of medical specialties, allowing you to see into the whole body with a simple flip of our industry-leading two-sided probe design. It connects wirelessly to your personal device and with its convex and high-frequency linear transducer combination, supports you in quickly ruling in or out certain conditions to accelerate treatment decisions at the point of care. VSCAN Air delivers clear images to support early diagnosis and help you monitor treatments. It is powered by our SignalMax technology, which makes it possible to deliver crystal clear images and the power of a high performance ultrasound machine within a small, lightweight, and wireless dual probe that comfortably fits in the palm of your hand. A clear image enables you to easily see structures inside your patient's body to enable accurate diagnosis and treatment decisions at the point of care, potentially resulting in fewer and shorter visits for your patients. Designed for the rigors of a diverse clinical environments, from the clinic to the home to transport, the probe is rugged, durable, and designed to go anywhere. It can withstand drops and is waterproof, allowing for high-level disinfection techniques. Its smooth and rounded design presents limited cracks to collect dirt or germs, also making it easier to clean. The cable-free wireless design is intended to provide flexibility in maneuvering the probe across different body parts with ease and provides an ergonomic advantage, especially during procedures. There are no hassles from bent or broken cables or risk to breaking the sterile field during guided procedures. A disposable probe cover can also be used. Additional workflow simplifying features on the probe include a physical button that can be personalized to your scanning needs, such as freeze or store, that can be beneficial during procedures. The VSCAN Air's easy to use and intuitive design is not just limited to the probe, it extends to the mobile application as well. GE Healthcare's award-winning Edison design system brings a user-centric and intuitive interface suitable for both smartphones and tablets. For example, the VSCAN Air app is designed to be predominantly used single-handedly, with features such as the ability to adjust depth and gain with a simple swipe of your thumb. The first time I fired up the VSCAN Air, it was, um, it, it, it did feel a little bit like stepping into the future. And when I think about other ultrasounds that are of comparable quality to the VSCAN Air, I have to bring them in, and I wouldn't be bringing that into every every patient's room. Many of us are pressed to really see patients, to give patients that access to care. And so, so the more time something takes is the less patients I can, I can uh, provide access to in a day. So the portability and ease of use is, is huge with the V-Scan Air. It was well-designed, powerful tool. It was beautiful, colorful, catching my eye from the very first sight. That's one of the things that impressed me most uh, to use a convex probe and get a face array probe image. That quality of image allow me to do all the interpretations I need. I'm in love with, uh, with you because of the cardiac image. I think that the, the smallest possible device is just the best device as long as the, the quality is here. And, and the quality is definitely here with, with this V-scan hair. Really, the, the ultrasound image that you get from this very small device is almost the same as the one you could get from, from a regular device. It's really amazing. The air allows me to uh, manage therapy a lot more in a much more targeted fashion with the goal of keeping the patient hopefully out of the emergency room and with the approach, uh, appropriate treatment right out of the gate. Viscan Air, I think what it's um, the plus, it's, it's, it's little, it's uh, very practical. Your image quality was, was very, very nice. I would definitely recommend the Viscan Air. It has no cable in, in factor settings. It's optimal, or optimally to clean. Uh, in the ICU setting, it's easy to use, uh, it's light, it's handy. I would definitely recommend uh, this portable device. When I see the majority of patients, they uh, get very excited when I take out the VSCAN Air. They are very intrigued by how it works. They have the greater sense of uh, that we're doing a better evaluation, that we're doing being more thorough, and they're excited to see the images that I'm able to obtain and understand what's going on with them. I think it provides a level of comfort that is sort of above and beyond what I'm normally able to provide. I would definitely recommend the V-Scan Air. It is very user-friendly. 
highly portable uh, pairs and connects to your your own personal devices easily, um, and that and that's huge. Let's see how to start using your VScan Air app. Please watch the videos on registration and activation and pairing to prepare your device prior to scanning. Once the probe is successfully connected with the app, you're ready to scan. The presets panel opens with the default preset loaded. Presets are grouped according to the transducers, deep scanning presets under the curved array, and shallow scanning under the linear array. The transducer is switched automatically based on the selected preset. Any preset can be set as the default by pressing and holding on it. It's readily identified by a white bar below the button. The left panel with the presets and menu options closes automatically after a preset is selected. It can be opened again by tapping on the probe and preset button on the top left hand corner or simply sliding it in from the left side of the imaging screen. A new exam is created automatically when the VScan Air Probe is turned on and successfully paired with the app. You can also create a new exam manually from the current exam gallery in the right-hand side panel. The imaging screen has a header that displays the status bar in the left corner, showing the probe connection and battery status. Next to it is the wireless connection quality indicator to check the stability of the connection of the probe with app. The thermometer icon indicates the probe temperature during a scan. The current preset icon is displayed next to it. Exam number can be seen on the right side. The orientation marker seen at one side of the image corresponds to the physical marker on either transducer. The blue line in the center, when enabled from settings, corresponds with the center line markings on the long axes of both transducer heads. On the right side of the image is the depth scale, with the depth displayed at the bottom. Focus marker is displayed in the area where the ultrasound beam is concentrated for maximum lateral resolution. The lower part of the image houses the color flow, freeze, and store buttons. These buttons shift to the left side when the image is being displayed in landscape orientation. To toggle between freeze and live scanning modes, you can press the freeze button or tap anywhere on the screen. Gain and depth gestures are available to adjust the image during live scanning. Overall gain can be adjusted by sliding a finger horizontally, at least half a centimeter from the left or right, anywhere on the image area. Brightness control on the top indicates the change in gain value. Depth can be changed by sliding the image upwards or downwards at least half a centimeter to move the region of interest into focus. It's also possible to pinch and zoom the image in and out and pan a specific area of the image. A zoom indicator is visible on the screen to indicate a zoomed image. On certain presets, there is a penetration button on the black and white live imaging screen, just above the controls at the bottom. This is useful for imaging at greater depths in larger than average or difficult to scan patients. You can toggle between penetration and resolution settings for the preset with this control. Image display is maximized in the portrait orientation for better visualization. At shallow depths on the linear presets, you see two yellow dashed lines on either side of the image. These indicate that the entire footprint of the transducer is not seen to display a large image. To see the entire image, either rotate the device to landscape or zoom and pan. Once a desired view has been obtained, you can save a still image or a video to the gallery. Freeze and press the store button to save a single frame. If you press store during live scanning, a video clip with all the frames in the image buffer is saved. Alternatively, to store a video, freeze, play the clip in the buffer, and press store.
The scroll bar in the freeze mode allows you to choose a desired frame in the buffer for saving or measuring. Move the slider to select a frame. VScan Air supports distance and ellipse measurements. Press Measure to activate the measurement mode. Move the calipers to position on the structure to be measured. Up to four distance measurements can be performed on a single image. To delete a measurement, tap on the caliper to select it, and then press Delete. Distance measurement calipers are activated by default. Press the Color button to activate the Color ROI. Color settings have been optimized according to the different presets. The ROI can be repositioned by touching anywhere in the middle of the box and moving it around. The box turns blue, indicating that the controls are active. The controls on the corners can be used to adjust the size. The size of the ROI has a significant effect on the frame rates and sensitivity, width more than the height. Keep the box sized just to fit the anatomy of interest. There are additional controls for steering of the color box on the Linear Array Transducer. Use the controls on the middle top and bottom of the ROI to slant the color flow acoustic beam for a Doppler angle, according to the transducer orientation. Color gain can be adjusted in the same way as black and white gain by sliding a finger horizontally across the image when scanning in color flow mode. On certain presets, there is a flow button on the Color Flow Live Imaging screen just above the controls at the bottom. This is useful for changing the velocity scale to optimize imaging for fast or slow flow, such as venous flow in the extremities or renal flow. You can toggle between high and low velocity scales within a preset. This is the latest evolution, the VSCAN Air. What makes this unique? The um, uh, VSCAN Air has uh, this uh, Signal Max technology, uh, which means that it really creates crystal clear uh, images. And then we have dedicated transducers. That means we do not have to compromise on the image quality for uh, both the deep and the shallow uh, imaging. And with this kind of a device, it just becomes very easy for, for, the, for the doctor to be able to look inside the whole body. Feels pretty ruggedized. Feels like you could throw this thing on the floor or drop it in a bucket of water and it, it would be fine. This has no cord, as you can see, so that means this is more prone to getting dropped. So we like to say that VSCAN Air has been designed, uh, you know, to, to be dropped. It has IP67 ratings, so that means not just only waterproof, but that rating also prevents dust or, or grime or, or gel or any kind of moisture to uh, enter. And, and not just that, it makes it very easy to clean. And uh, because of this complete waterproof um, wow. uh, design, it is also very amenable to high level disinfection. Tell me about the app. It's been designed so that you can scan with one hand. At the same time, you're able to navigate uh, the app from with the other hand, all the thumb right. uh, movement. So most of the primary functions are accessible with, with one thumb, and uh, you should be able to operate the app with one, one hand.